Alright, so here's part 16 of Ocarina of Time, a.k.a. part 2 of the Forest Temple. So right now we're just trying to figure out where to go. Well, first we're getting rid of this guy. But basically, as you're about to find out, oh, we're going to climb up here only to find out that uh, we're at a dead end. So, yeah, we'll just get rid of this guy. And then get rid of him, too. So, yeah, you can see there's a door there, but we need a key, so we're going to have to go back and find one. What do we end up doing? Well, yeah, obviously, um, we have to backtrack. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna head in here. And here I was trying to do a backflip, but was not. I was failing to do it. So yeah, just head down the stairs. And then into the door. So... Yep, just skip everything that's there. Alright. Let's see, then get up here. Into this door. Alright. Oh yeah, and the, the shadow monster was about to fall. Get rid of that. That climb your way up. Yeah, there is. Okay. Yeah, we will get that treasure here in a second. What we gotta do is we need to go back into this door. change the platform, It'll just change the whole area. So now we can get the boss key, that's right here. Here you actually have to battle these guys. Yeah, and I was way too close to this guy. Yeah, I'm just taking like a lot of damage. After that, just go into the door. This shadow monster is not like any of the other ones we've fought. Here I was being really stupid and should have been using the shield, but I didn't. Oh, I'm a 
forget if you can get a key in here or not. I believe there is a key that you can get. I just... Ugh. Yeah, I, I don't know if this is actually a key that we need. Or... Yeah, I just wasn't sure if the treasure chest had the key, but yeah. There's a key in there, and then... Before I went into the door, like... I came over here, and then I saw, like, oh, this area is, like, where we came from before, so we... I backtracked because I wanted to see if, if I could get some heart pieces. Because I saw a few hearts over on the other side. So I wanted to grab those real quick. I actually ended up grabbing more than just those. I also ended up getting a few gold scotulas. See, so yeah, I grabbed those. And yeah, the sound of you being low on hearts is also really annoying to hear. I heard a gold scotula, but I couldn't tell where it was at. Oh, there. Uh, here I am, just starting to fall off. You know, I don't know why that is. There we go, get rid of him. And there we go. So I don't really think there's anything else I can go or get, so I think I should just go ahead and head into the door. Yeah, there was still that one gold scotula that I didn't get, but, you know, I'm just not going to worry about it. Damn it, I'm taking hits again. I think I ended up going the wrong way at some point. Yeah, because I had the key. So, I had to go back and climb all the way back to the top. See, so I'm just gonna go this way. Yeah, I was having a hard time trying to get up here. Like, I don't know why it wasn't letting me climb, but... Yeah, it was really strange. Yeah, it happened again. again. Alright, so just keep making your way across and then head into the door. Alright, and then just back flip your way down. So, at this point, there really isn't just much to talk about right now other than the fact that you just need to try to get back to where you were at before. <laughs> now that we finally have the key, we can finally go into the next door, which is where we'll be battling the third post sister. So let's see here, try to get rid of the skeleton enemy. Green Bubble, I think, is actually what it's called, since the last video we 
found out that they were called blue bubbles. Well, at least the ones that were glowing blue were called blue bubbles. So, yeah. Alright, so here we are in this little area. So here you're actually supposed to use an arrow and aim for the for that eye by aiming the arrow through that torch, but as you can see it wasn't working out well. I had to keep going around and around just until I got it right. And yeah. I think it was after either two or three attempts that I just decided, you know, I just don't really care. I was just gonna go for uh Dense fire. Yeah, right here. I was like, you know, I have dense fire. I'm sure it'll work. And sure enough, it actually did work. Just get off the platform and then. Here I saw two jars, which one had a heart and then a few had. and then another with arrows, which I really didn't care for. Since I got more than enough arrows. Alright, so just get on here and then. Make your way into the door. And the green bubbles are still there. Even though it's all twisted, they're still there. Shadow monster, and then grab the rupees. All right, and then just climb up here. Yeah, there really was. I don't know why I even went in that door. But yeah, just head down here. So there's a switch over there that we gotta hit. Now this part in the game I was being really stupid and just not really watching out where I was going. Thinking that none of the Skotulas would fall, I encountered a few of them. Like, I don't even know what happened there. I was trying to hit him with the with the hook shot, and for some reason, it glitched and wouldn't let me do that. So. And yeah, I'm calling glitches out on that. I think it's also kind of stupid that these guys, like, constantly respawn even when you die. Or you just get sent back from the, the beginning part. See what's in this treasure chest. More arrow arrows that I don't even need. Alright, so just heading to this door, and then in here is where you're gonna be facing one of the Post Sisters.
So here you have to solve this little puzzle, and I had to do a cut here because I messed up. So yeah, this is like a little jigsaw puzzle that you have to solve. And one of them you don't even have to use. Like that black one we're not going to use because we don't have any need for it. But basically you have to solve this puzzle under a minute. Um, which do I succeed in it? Yes. Uh -huh. So what you're going to do is push that in. Same thing with this one. Although this one, I think I had pushed too far out. So that in itself kind of screwed me over. But I got this one under. Or I was able to get it before the time ran out. So once um, you defeat her, you can move on to the next door. Here's where you'll find the last um, post sister, final one. Yeah, this heart took me a while to figure out what I was supposed to do, but um, it turns out you have to basically just aim at the one that's at the odd one out. Basically, if you notice a strange movement, ugh, a strange movement um, between one of them, you'll know it's the real one. This one's named Meg. That's actually how I found out that these guys were Poe's sisters. Was, yeah, I basically looked up the hint because I couldn't figure out how to beat how to beat this last one, so I had to see if Navi could help. And yeah, basically the one that's spinning is the one you gotta hit. Just lit. Alright, well, I think for the most part, though, that's basically the end of this video. Um, in the next video, we'll take on the boss, and then that'll basically be the end of the forest temple. So, until then, this is Luigi Rocks 2014 signing out, and I'll see you guys. Part 17, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, I'll just see you guys in the next video. Basically, not much else really goes on other than me just trying to grab a few items, trying to heal up. And you can see it just doesn't work out. So yeah, see you guys next time.